it was a bunch of guys, like I said, it's, it's a tight knit group. You don't get that everywhere you go. And uh, like I said, I've been on a lot of teams, and you know, just just the feel and the morale of this team is, is a good good feel. And um, you know, I'm wondering why it was only two wins. You know what I mean? But um, I see the type of guys that's in here, and you know, the way they practice this week, um, they definitely hungry for a win. And uh, you know, it showed up in the game. So definitely still got some some work to do. But. I'm impressed you about Blaine Gabbert. I mean, his first start since 2013, he's kind of in the same boat. Oh, yeah, Blaine's a good guy. He's, um, I met with Blaine a couple times also, you know, just to hear his, his lingo and, you know, just to get around what he's uh, what he's feeling about the game. And, uh, he, he's a take charge type of guy. Um, I don't know if y'all heard or seen what, you know, when he got taken out of the game, he's a competitive guy also. Um, he, he was hot about that, but you know he's a good guy. He's a take charge. And, um, he sits in the pocket if he needs to, and takes off and make big plays with his feet. And that's, I mean, you need that. And what about your readiness to jump into the fray with just a few days prep? And how long you been out of the game? Uh, I, I really haven't played offense in a while. I, I mean, I'm playing special teams. I got released like two, three weeks ago from the Browns. Um, so you know, I was out too bad, but you know it was, it was. A bit of an adjustment, but you know when you when you call, this, that's the part of the job. Yeah, and, and you're shaking, baking, a little cut and go. Mm -hmm. you, you still got that. You can't take that away two weeks, <laughs> two weeks away from the game. Yeah, I guess if you got it, you got it. Yeah. <laughs> did, did you know going into the game that you were going to be used as much as you were uh, and get to start? Was it something that just that's how the game played out? No, I actually didn't. Um, my coach walked up to me during pregame. He's like, "Oh, you starting by the way." Um, and I was like, okay, let's go. Um, but he, you know, during the week he said that, you know, we, we would play and he, they would use us, but we just didn't know how much. Um, so, you know, it's, I guess they they made a decision and went with it. 30 yard run was the longest of your career. Mm -hmm. now, how'd that play open up for you and you just didn't feel a little bit? Uh, it, was, it was a draw play and the, the line did a great job of uh, ex executing the way that it was drawn up. You know, you don't really get the looks that you, you want with certain plays, but you know, we got the look we wanted. And they, they slammed it down, and you know I kind of tried to break, break a tackle and get in the open field, and see what see what was out there. This is kind of a cheesy question, but for a guy who's been playing predominantly special teams, mm -hmm. to get as much, many touches as you did in a win, I mean, how much how much fun was that? Oh, it was it was great, man. I, I've been praying for this opportunity for so long. It, it's just like I said, 18s, man. That, that don't happen often, you know. Especially you know you skip from team to team, and then you come in a week. And you're starting, that doesn't happen, man. I'm, I'm just, I'm just thankful and humble for the opportunity that you know the coaches gave me. So what were you gonna do in last Sunday? Last Sunday, I was watching a little bit of the 49ers. Where? I back was watching in, in Cleveland. Your home? In Cleveland, yep. Um, with my wife couch? and kids, yep. I was watching Sunday football. <laughs> that's, that's what I was doing. As bottle up the box of popcorn. And uh, I think I had some Chipotle actually. Yeah, yeah a little Chipotle. So you're on the couch, and I was now on the couch. you're. I was you're, on the on the, you're in the spotlight. <laughs> hey, man, that's, that's, that's the way things work sometimes. You know, God got a, a different plan for different people. And, uh, you know, I've been, you know, through some things. But, you know, it's all about faith. Just keeping your faith.